slow down, squad. When I tell you to slow down, I'm gonna need you to slow down. You hear me? And today, uh, so look, man. Last night, last night I had, um, what's something I rarely do is, you know what I'm saying? Only time I actually, like, go look through my video is when I got, like, or some beef shit going on. And I gotta, I gotta like fact check. You know what I mean? I gotta pull facts. But man, I was going through, uh, I was going through some of my old videos, bruh. And I'm just looking, I'm just reading the comments and shit. And I remember, I remember all of the bullshit started around a thousand subscribers. And I remember that. Mind y'all, I didn't come in here on no breeding shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I didn't come on no breeding shit. Like, I came in, you know, showing niggas how to get their dog shots, dewormers, and, like, the raw meat diet. And I would, like, every fucking time I would post a video, like, you know what I'm saying? And this is, like, this is right around the time when I had a thousand subscribers. And they just always used to be in the comment section saying, well, if you was a breeder, you would know that you don't have to do that. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, see, it confuses you. Like, what the fuck? Like, where are y'all getting this shit from? I don't have no breeding videos. Like, what video did I have breeding to where every time I make a video or every time a dog does something wrong, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, a motherfucker is talking about me being a bad breeder, right? So this is around a thousand subscribers. So I had a video, um, I'm sitting on my couch and I'm telling the niggas, like, if I haven't had no puppies, I'm not a breeder. Like, if I haven't had any puppies, then I can't call myself a breeder. Until I start breeding, I like, you can't, you can't try to criticize me of breeding rights when I don't even have no breeders, no litters, no nothing, right? All right. So that was... A lot that was going on back then. So, now this used to be the, this used to be, let me just give you a little bit of the journey. Um, so, whenever somebody feels like I have to learn how to take constructive criticism, let me just give you a little, little back story, just real quick, you know what I'm saying? This was a thousand subscribers, right? A thousand subscribers is when I first start getting the most backlash for everything. And we talking about almost three years ago. All right. Well, I can't say the most because nobody would make videos about me. So I can't say the most. But there was it was it's always something. So first I was a breeder. When I never I never made not one video saying anything about um breeding dogs. Then then <laughs> they would get mad if I called the dogs pit bulls. They like, man, you calling these pit bulls? Them ain't pit bulls, them bullies. Now, this was around the game dog era. Like, cause in, 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 in the beginning, well, not in the beginning, but like after a thousand subscribers, it was a lot of game dog niggas. So like, you know what I'm saying? A lot of the game dog niggas and, and, and shit, they would always have something to say. Them ain't no pit bulls, them bullies, right? Every time I post a video, every video I post, that's what I would get, right? So then I start calling the drink bullies. <laughs> right? So then I start calling them bullies. And then that attracted a whole nother fucking crowd. You know what I'm saying? Them, them, ain't, them ain't bullies, them pit bulls. <laughs> and so I remember I used to sit back and look at Christina and I would be so fucking confused like, what the fuck is going on right now, right? All right. So that's when I will always put American Bully, Blue Pit Bull. And when I would put that shit in the title, that was just for it to pop up. Like, when it, when the way it looks, when it pop up. You know what I'm saying? So, um, then, fast com coming down, coming, coming down, coming down, later down the line, um, I also made a video when I had um, 3,000 subscribers. And 
you know, I was getting congratulated and everything, and, and I made a video letting them know, like, I can't really act like I'm happy for having 3,000 subscribers because I don't get 3,000 views. So for me, I don't give a fuck. Like, it doesn't mean shit to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't know YouTube was gonna be like this. I didn't know it was like this. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know people subscribed to you and didn't watch. So when I like work my ass off to get the 3,000, I'm talking about doing giveaways, all that shit. I'm talking about I was doing a lot. And to, to be like, damn, a motherfucker subscribe and then don't even watch. Now, I didn't know nothing about um, the notification bell and if you get thumbs up, it puts the video in the algorithm so that attracts more people. You know what I mean? I knew nothing about that at 3,000 subscribers. You know what I'm saying? So I, I made a video and I was like, man, I'm, I'm just like, I don't care. Like, I don't even, I don't get 3,000 views not knowing that, you know what I'm saying, just because you got 3,000 people that follow you don't mean 3,000 people gonna watch you. So then, as I fast forward a little bit more, um, like probably like right around the time that I got uh, Meech. So like that's when I had Coco and shit. And then this is when I learned that no matter what, so I probably had maybe like 8,000 subscribers, but around like 8,000 subscribers is when I learned no matter what, that it, it, nothing that nothing that I'm gonna do is gonna be, I'm not gonna satisfy. So around 8,000 subscribers, I told myself what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna use negative shit, turn it into positive shit, make jokes about it you know what i'm saying so that's when i start getting into basically trolling the niggas that troll me you know what i'm saying and see this is something that i thought about because i couldn't understand because i'm like i'm trying to do everything and i'm being real about the shit you know what i'm saying i'm not sitting here acting like i got the best dogs in the world i'm not sitting here acting like i'm the most educated nigga with the dogs i'm not sitting here acting like i'm the best breeder i'm just a nigga holding a camera Showing my animals, you know what I'm saying? And if I'm like being a real nigga like that, I'm still gonna get this. I said, all right, let me profit off that. Now, nowadays, y'all look at that like, oh, fuck the haters, don't worry about the haters. But I've been thinking about this from 8,000 subscribers. And I realized that when I did that, when I would troll this niggas that troll me, that's how I gained all my subscribers. I didn't gain no fucking subscribers from from nothing more, nothing less but being a nigga who made people feel comfortable to speak up for themselves. You know what I'm saying? I so that's what I start doing. Because I'ma make if you you wanna try to make me look stupid, you know what I mean? So what 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 law is it that you can say something about me, but if I say something back, I'm wrong. You feel me? So I learned that at 8,000 subscribers and, and I just, I'd rather just make videos trolling niggas and, and laughing and you know, a nigga tell me this and tell me that then I make it in the video. I felt like that was a better way to do it versus typing back, you know what I'm saying? In the comment section. Cause I used to type in the comment section until I told myself, you know what? Let me just say what the fuck I got to say. So I, right. then we fast forward a little bit later I had to get rid of Coco because Coco wasn't what I thought she was. Um, nigga was salty. But at the end of the day, see, I'm, I'm going through this dog shit. And I'm doing all of this dog shit. And I'm learning shit as I go. Now, and, 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 and then it, it, it's like, when you learning as you go, you know what I'm saying? You're going to make mistakes. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 didn't, I didn't cheat. I didn't take the easy route. I actually did this shit and I learned. I learned from mistakes that I made. I learned from shit that I did, you know what I'm saying? And um what I did was I just I just, you know, learned that all right, nigga, you can't go get no $500 dog. You can't, you know what I'm saying? Like it's learning shit. All right, you want you want a dog that look like this, you know you going to have to pay this amount of money. You want a dog that look like that, you know you got to pay that amount of money. You know what I'm saying? So I always what bullshit on doing that but then so as it as i'm getting closer to you know 
this time and day, this time of day, I sit back and I watch all those videos and I'm like, damn, a nigga told me I had to learn how to take constructive criticism. I've been going through this shit for three years. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I like when you when you sit back to yourself and you think about that shit, you like, damn. So a nigga don't know how to take constructive criticism. But ain't that. But if I'm not mistaken, right? If you criticize me, ain't I allowed to criticize back? Hmm. Maybe that's not maybe that's not the truth. Maybe if somebody tries to give you constructive criticism, you're, what you're supposed to do is not say anything. You're supposed to just not say nothing. Because constructive criticism is nothing but an opinion. You feel me? So that doesn't mean necessarily if you have con a constructive criticism, that means what you're saying is, is, is correct. So it's more so of a, an opinion. So I just was looking like, damn, bro, like I literally been, I literally been going through this shit, bro. Like, this shit ain't been doing shit but getting worse and worse, right? So I'm like, damn. So how the fuck ain't I able to take constructive criticism? That shit, wow. And then I was then I was looking like, oh man, yeah, you got low level dogs, and I'm like, well, damn, I think like the. It's ice right, so in my mind, right? In my mind, I jump out there like that, bro. Like, listen. I'm saying my car faster than yours. Nigga, bet my shit any day. Bet my shit any day. And then I just keep getting smoked. You know what I'm saying? And then a nigga be like, nigga, you got that bullshit ass motor in there. You need to step your game up. That's how I look at something, something like that. You know what I'm saying? But when it comes to the dog, I don't, I don't, for, 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 for me to be told I got low level dogs, when the fuck do I say I got high level dogs? You know what I'm saying? So I be, I be, I'm just, it be just shit I be thinking about. But then it's shit that I actually start breaking down last night while I'm looking through all of these old videos. When the fuck do I say I got the best dogs? Then I be thinking like, damn. So a nigga will be pressed just to say that shit. But then you know you got, you got my supporters who say. Well, if you ain't got no haters, you ain't popping, nigga. That's bullshit. But just because you got haters don't mean that you popping because there is some, there is some, a such thing as, you know what I'm saying? It's a such thing as motherfucking having. Like, 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 it's a such thing as having uh, bad publicity. You know what I'm saying? All publicity is good publicity, but shit, you don't want to just always have bad publicity. You know what I'm saying? You don't always want to do that. So it'd be like, damn, that shit be crazy. But then it'd be like, I'd be feeling like, now this one, I would get into like my little trolling shit. I would feel like, all right, well, if a motherfucker gonna keep telling me how bad my dogs is, I'm about to start saying how good my dogs is to really give a nigga a reason to say if my dogs are good or bad. You see what I'm saying? Like, it's like the reverse psychology part of it. You know what I'm saying? Because if I'm not talking, if I'm not big up in my dogs, if I'm not making like I got the best dogs in the fucking world, why would anybody else feel to say that the dogs are not the best dogs? So maybe if I start, maybe, maybe if I start jumping out there, because I can actually do it. I definitely can jump out there and talk shit about my dogs. Maybe that might be what I start doing. I might start, I might piss niggas off and, and by, by doing what they doing to me, but just me doing it in a positive way. My dogs is bullshit, that's negative. So man, maybe I need to start saying my dogs ain't bullshit, that'll be positive. You know what I'm saying? This just thoughts I had though, man. You know what I'm saying? Um excuse me. But after this video, man, y'all make sure y'all check the um Y'all make sure y'all check the Thanksgiving video. Y'all don't want no drama, like I say all the time. Y'all don't want no drama. Y'all don't want me crying. Y'all don't want me trolling the trolls. Then y'all motherfuckers watch the other videos too. So you you want you want happy shit, you you want all of that good old shit. Watch all the other videos, and salute to the motherfucking slowdown squad who watch no, no watch no, no matter what I drop, they watch. You know what I'm saying? So y'all niggas be easy. I'm about to get the fuck out of here to the next video. Slow down, squad.
I'm going 85 on a one way road with a thing to my head, thinking gone, let it go. Nigga, you should go thank deacons on a real lot of nigga ever said was we just gone, let it go. Some street trapping, let a nigga to a situation that I never thought it'd be. Plus, I'm a nigga from another fucking city, so they looking at a 